Now, even with the new cases, Geisinger is urging everyone to keep calm and remember the world's other medical emergencies haven't come to a halt. These tents are precautionary measures so that if the worst does happen, they will be able to treat everyone, coronavirus or otherwise. And as Geisinger continues to take extra measures to ensure care for future issues, many Pennsylvanians stocked up today for an immediate one. Our own Julie Dunphy was out and about with lines out the door as state-run liquor stores gave last call. I just came to pick up something for my friend. Slim pickings. Bear shelves are seen in fine wine and good spirits Tuesday night after Pennsylvania announces an indefinite closure of state liquor stores by 9 p.m. And customers predicted the empty shelves. Not at all. Not at all. I expected it, actually. I expected to see a line, really. The line picked up after 5 p.m., making its way to the back of the store. But the crowd didn't stop people from checking for their favorites. If not, it's going to be a dry out period, I guess. Or from taking extra safety measures. It's just the safety of everyone that's around me as well, because I'm not sick, and I don't need to get sick from anyone else, and I don't want to get anyone else sick. Just being clean and staying safe. Really, you know, we have kids, you know, our parents are older too, so, you know, it's just basically being clean. Now, I've been told by employees that hundreds of people have been making their way into the store today, and as you can see, the shelves are looking a little bit dry. Toward the end of the month, the Liquor Control Board will reevaluate its operations. They've been blindsided, so they just got to keep bailing water till they figure it out. But, it, you know, it could last. It could last. I just hope they can keep the businesses afloat and take care of us second, I guess. But at the end of the day, most shoppers were at the liquor store to get in and get out. Everybody should be careful. You know, stay home. In Pittston Township, Julie Dunphy, Eyewitness News. And grocery stores that sell wine and beer will not be prohibited from doing so, so you will still be able to get those items.